Progressives for Pilots, key the intro music. Thank you so much for joining me. As always, I'm Eyeglass Tyler, an optician with SportRx. Welcome again to my home where I am staying safe and comfortable. I wanna to talk to you about progressives for pilots. I think the best way to tackle this topic is to first answer the question, can pilots wear progressives? Then I will talk about aviators for progressives. Of course, we have to. We're talking about pilots. I'll talk about best progressives for pilots and I will end on a little note about polarized lenses. So come fly with me. Now let's start off with an easy one. Can pilots wear progressives? Probably. It really depends on the person. If you are a progressive wearer, which I imagine you are, and if you're a pilot, you have an idea of what you need when you're looking through your lenses. And so hopefully you have an idea of what works well for you. But of course you have to understand how progressives work and you have to understand the downside to progressives, which is the peripheral vision distortion. The benefit of progressives is convenience and you have everything in the one lens. You have the distance up top, you have the reading in the bottom, everything in between as you scroll down that lens. And so of course, with all the instrumentation that you're dealing with, it will make it easier to see everything. However, there is still the downside that you kind of have to point your nose at the things that you're looking at. And so that may be a bit of an obstacle to overcome, but at the same time, you need to be able to see that. And so there's not a perfect pair that allows you to see you know, all the way across the lens in every different focal length. And so progressives are probably the best solution for you, but everyone is going to be different. And so this is going to be my recommendation to understand what works well for you and understand what works well when you're sitting in the cockpit. Now let's talk aviators and progressives. We have to talk aviators because we're talking about the aviators, pilots, right? You've been watching the video, you know what we're talking about by now. Well, they are called aviators actually for good reason because the juggernaut of optics, Bausch and Lomb, they have been around forever, just about as long as there have been eyes. They created this design originally in 1936. And of course they created it for pilots. And it's a fantastic design and really good for progressives because of how much lens height there is. It is a very large lens and there's plenty of room to fit everything that you need in a progressive and room to share really and truly is a good option. So if you're a pilot, you love that classic look, great for progressives. And now for the best progressives for pilots. While I don't have a specific design because there are so many out there, I have a good guideline to follow. And that is to make sure that you get the best design available to you. And that means digital, that means free form because that is going to minimize the problem of progressive as much as possible. As we all know, the problem of progressive is the distortion, that peripheral vision distortion, especially in the intermediate and reading areas that are going to be very important concerning the instrumentation for a pilot. And so you wanna make sure that you have the widest field of view possible, and this is only possible with that better digital and free form design. And so the rule definitely applies here. You get what you pay for. So make sure you don't skimp on this. And if you don't, you won't be sorry. And now for my note on polarized lenses. If you're a pilot, you very likely already know this, but pretty much across the board, you wanna avoid it. Whether it be the windshield that's polarized or the instrumentation that's polarized, having a polarized lens that you're looking through and then a polarized thing that you're looking at is a really bad idea. It's either going to black out your vision or it's going to cause really distracting waves or whatever the case is, avoid polarized if you're a pilot. That pretty well covers what I think is important to know about progressives for pilots. And hopefully now, after I explained the simple, not so simple question of can pilots wear progressives, I talked aviators, of course we talked aviators, and the best progressives and polarized, you now have a better idea of what's right for you and your pair. By the way, if you decide to order from Sport RX, thanks to our See Better guarantee, you never have to worry about getting something that isn't right or doesn't work for you. Just get back to us within 45 days and we'll take care of you. Also, we have opticians who would love to help you get it right the first time. So reach out to us. Thank you so much 
much for watching. Hopefully this was relevant or interesting information to you. If so, throw us a like. I would love it. We have relevant videos to check out there. If you subscribe, you're going to hear about those relevant videos first. And also, we have good content on our social media outlets. Check us out at SportRx. Thank you.